it's counselor Kate here again with another soccer video today's video is going to be a little different it's going to be on some goalie skills and I have my twin sister Erica here to show you those skills today hi everyone I'm Erica I was actually a camper at JCC for eight years and I play goalie on both of the teams Kate and I play on so in order to warm up today you're gonna go over the stretches that Kate showed you in her first two videos and then we're gonna work on some easy hand drills to do. So for today, if you have goalie gloves, you're welcome to wear them, but you don't have to. So I won't be wearing my goalie gloves today either. So we're gonna start really simple. You're gonna put the ball on the ground with your feet together, and you're just gonna work on rolling the ball with your hands around your feet. So this will help you get comfortable with the ball. And once you're feeling good, you can bring the ball up and work on passing it between your hands, around your knees, and then you can also pass around your waist as well. Moving on from that, once you do that for a little while, we're gonna put your feet about shoulder width apart, the ball on the ground again, and you're gonna pass it around your legs in a figure eight pattern. So you go around one foot, around back, and then around the other foot. And then once again, once you're feeling comfortable, you can bring it up to your knees, get a little bend in your legs, and pass it around in a figure eight in the air. And then finally, a little bit more of a challenge. You wanna start once again with your legs apart, the ball in your hands. You're gonna put one arm in front of your body and one in the back, and you're gonna throw the ball up and try to switch your arms as quickly as you can to catch the ball. If that's a little too challenging and you're on um, a surface that can bounce well, like a driveway, you can try to get it to bounce in between. Catching it on one bounce. So that way it'll be a little easier. So these drills are really good to do to get comfortable with the ball in your hands. So now we're gonna go over um, your hand position on the ball. So what you really wanna try to do is get your hands on a diamond shape in the ball. So this is the best way to catch the ball. If that's a little too hard because the ball's too big or something, then you can try and get a W with your hands like I have. And whenever you're catching the ball, you wanna make sure that your hands are behind the ball. That way it doesn't get past you. So in order to get more comfortable with how we're holding the ball, you're gonna start with your hands in the proper position. You're going to just bounce the ball on the ground and catch it again. Just bounce and catch. Really every time, catch the ball and make sure you're holding it in the right way. And it's okay if you drop it, just pick it up and keep on going again. And then once you're comfortable with that, you can start shuffling around a little bit, get moving, bounce the ball, catch it, make sure you're still using the right form. Now we're gonna work on um, catching the ball as it's coming towards us. So in order to keep it as simple as possible, you're gonna get onto your knees and you'll have to find a sibling or a parent to help you out. And then they're just gonna give you nice, easy tosses to your hands. Once again, make sure you're using the proper um, form. Throw it back to your hands again. Make sure you're keeping your hands behind the ball so that it doesn't hit you in the face or anything. Just nice soft throws. And then to switch it up a little bit too, you can sit down with your knees in front of you. And now um, whoever's throwing the ball is gonna throw it over your head a little bit. As you catch it, you're gonna come down, come back up and throw it back. Catch it with the proper form, come down, come back up and throw it back. So both of these drills will really help you just get comfortable catching the ball. We're not doing anything crazy today, just really basic skills. The last skill we're gonna go over today is rolling the ball. So being able to roll the ball is really important because once you make a save, you have to be able to distribute it out to your teammates so they can turn around and try to get up to the other team's goal. So in order to roll the ball, you're gonna hold it in one hand with your hand up and against your arm so that you can keep it stable. And then you're gonna get really close to the ground like you're bowling the ball 
right on the ground and you're going to release it and roll it away. So once again, here we go. I'm going to hold the ball against my arm, get really close and roll it away. So that's all we have for today. Thanks to my special guest for helping me and I hope you enjoyed these goalie skills. Don't forget you can also post them on the Facebook group. Thanks for Thanks watching. For watching.